Today we're going to be changing the Haldex fluid in a 2017 Volkswagen Sport Wagon 4 motion. Uh, this is the Haldex fluid that controls the uh, four wheel drive and you should change this every 30,000 miles. So I jacked up the car by um, putting it up on ramps first in the rear, set the parking brake, and then I jacked it up in the front so that it's level and I used a uh, level like this and got it pretty pretty close to level and this is the only tools that you need is the the 8 allen wrench the 5 allen wrench um, some kind of pump and the uh, Haldex fluid which is the G06017582 and also I got the replacement uh, filler plug and the replacement drain plug and I got all this stuff from FCP Euro I'll have some links in the description of different places where you can buy this stuff in the back past the uh, driver's side okay so now we're under the car and I'm in the back obviously and this right here is the Haldex so let me just show you where the fill plug is it's right up here and um yeah that's the fill plug and the drain plug is right here Right there. So, don't get confused. This is the drain. This is the fill. Sometimes people will try try to drain it from here and fill it from here. That is the rear differential. If you drain this and fill it up here you will have an overfilled Haldex and an empty differential. And then your rear differential will grenade. And that has happened to people. I saw somebody on Facebook that happened to, and they're like, oh, I did it the right way. I know I did it the right way. Well, luckily they got it covered under warranty. He didn't tell the uh, dealer that they did it wrong. So on the differential, this is the fill and that's the drain. And you should also do that, but that takes gear lube, not Haldex oil. Um, okay, so this this one here. This one here, that's it. That's a, this top one is a 5. This one is an 8. Alright, also, coming from the back again, um, right here is the motor. And you're going to take this off with this bolt right here and one on the other side. Alright, it's recording. Alright, so here's the fill plug. And here is the drain plug. Alright, I'm going to put the new uh, drain plug in.
good. All right, now we're gonna take off the uh, pump. And that's the T30 up there, and there's another one on the bottom. So they're very not tight. Alright, now supposedly this is just supposed to pull out of here. Oh, there she goes. Does not look dirty. Yep. That's pretty clean. I'm just going to put it back together. Yeah, you can see that. There's not any dirt on there at all. Stick it back in there. Alright, I got new bolts, so I might as well use them. But I don't think I need to. These, don't even have, these old ones don't even have washers on them, so... I don't know. I'm just going to use the old ones. Must be still going in. Okay, that's leaking out for sure. Yep. All right, all right. All right now. Just to start it up and then put more in. Alright, so I just started it up for two minutes and pick it out. It's back in here. Alright, that's the end of the bottle. And it's leaking out, so put the new plug in.
that's it. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Bye. Auf Wiedersehen.